Hi, Kenyon Blossom here and welcome to my wash day video. These are some of the products that I use, although on this day I didn't use the deep conditioner from Share Moisture. I have a lot of hair so I prefer washing it in sections, small sections. This is step one where I wet the hair. Okay, this is the second step in cleaning my hair. So I'm shampooing my scalp. Just massage the shampoo into my scalp. So relaxing. After cleaning the section sufficiently, it's time for me to rinse the hair. And if you noticed, I put too much shampoo for this section. Don't do that. <laughs> that was a mistake. All right, to rinse the hair. After I'm done, I put the hair back into twists. Ow! <laughs> I gently pull my hair to avoid forming tangles as I scrub the scalp and the hair. I finger detangle as I rinse the hair. This can be done while standing. Anyways, I changed and started putting my hair in bantu knots instead because they are easy to work with when conditioning and oiling the hair later. I didn't get enough sleep yesterday night and so I'm really tired today. I decided to skip the, the deep conditioning step and will instead condition my hair with this leave-in conditioner from Cream on Nature. It's almost done. I will also oil the hair with this Hohober oil. I'm going to work on each section, conditioning and oiling.
Just using a small amount of conditioner. The hair isn't too tangled because I tangle I dried detangled. Perfect. Now to add the oil. Oh, oh oops, my bad. I think you open up here. Oh yeah, there's a small cup. So this pointy pad is the applicator and so I want to apply the oil on my scalp. Gently rub it in. Oops. Then applying some oil through the length of the of the hair. Adding some oil to the ends of the hair, giving them extra care. There we go. Cutting it back in a bantu knot not too tight moving on to the next 